This year's Clint. This year's Jim Bob. And we're here to teach you about some shit that you didn't know. That's right. We know a lot of things, and uh, one of those things is laws. That's right. Well, we're going to go through all the states and tell you all the dumbass laws that are still on the books that you better know about. That's right, because you might get arrested for doing some dumb shit that you don't realize is a law. That's right. There are good laws. There are bad laws. There are some laws that are just dumb laws. That's right. We're back again. That's right. With Illinois. Illinois. Here we go. Let's yep. get it started here. Popping off number one. You want to do it? Fuck it. It is against the law to have sex with a corpse in Illinois. <laughs> well, that's a good law. It should be against the law to have sex with a corpse. Everywhere. Anywhere. <laughs> in the whole world. That's just fucked up. And you're disgusting if you want to yes, do that. You are. Jeez, guys, what are you doing? Hey, remember, there? these laws were made for a reason. And this isn't all Illinois people. This is something that might have happened one time down the street, you know. All in right. Illinois because it made it a law in Illinois. Yes, yeah, so that's kind of weird. Uh, all right, so sex offenders in Illinois are prohibited from participating in holiday events like handing out candy at Halloween, that makes sense, and Easter for or dressing like Santa at Christmas, except under cir certain circumstances. Now, the fine writing is what I'm concerned about. What are these circum certain circumstances? <laughs> Specific circumstances. Specific Jeez. circumstances. He can't talk. <laughs> we have been drinking all day. But what I'm saying out. is, you know, these guys shouldn't be dressing up as Santa Claus or none of that. Under no circumstances. Under none of, none of that, what he just said. <laughs> Jeez. On the second thought, let's just be ahead and be done with it. Jeez, can, for real, though, if you keep doing it, jeez. Or if you do it, I don't If you do it once, that's enough. I mean, now, these, we're talking, I don't want to get into the whole laws and logistics of sex offenders, but if you're found guilty... And it's a sexual offense. Yeah. Like a crime. Yeah. It's not just some girl crying rape because she, you broke up with her down well, the road yeah, and she had a little hissy fit about it. I'm talking yeah. like legitimate fucking sexual offense. Yeah, you're like touching little kids or something. Yeah, just behead them and be done with it. Dig a big fucking hole, push their bodies yeah, in. Yeah, well, maybe. Set them know, on blaze. YouTube's kind of. You know what? Maybe even down. fucking douse a little extra gas on there We're so just you make kidding. sure that the bodies burn out properly. We're just kidding. No. Not really. Not really. At all. All right, next one. But we're kidding, though. All right, so, uh, uh, yeah, all right. <laughs> who's but under all 21 right. can drink legally? Damn right. But they must be enrolled in a culinary program to do so. <laughs> well, wow. If I lived there, if I was five years old, I'd be like, man, I want to get me. I'm going to be a fucking chef. Culinary circumstances. That's weird. You can drink under 21 legally, but you must be enrolled in a culinary program. Sounds fair to me. I, like I said, I'm all right with it. Like that's, that's like, hey, you want to be a little bastard? Be a little bastard that can cook. People would say, Jim Bob, why are you a world-renowned chef? And I'd say, well, because I was allowed to drink when I was five. I've been cooking since five. That's a long story. All right. All right. It is illegal to hang obstructions. I got it. I've been working. I've been, <laughs> I know your whole circumstances I, thing. Well, yeah. I'll, you know, just drinking a little bit. All right. It is illegal to hang obstructions form the rear view mirror. Fro oh, it's from. supposed to be from. Yeah. Uh, damn. Uh, uh, www.dumblaws.com. All right. Uh, <laughs> all right. It is legal to hug, uh, hang. <laughs> I, can't, I can't talk to Come on, Jim Bob. Who get it together? I'm a goddamn professional. All right. That's right. It is illegal to hang obstructions from the rear view mirror, including fuzzy dice, air fresheners, GPS units, etc. Now I've heard that before. I've heard. I think it's illegal. I think it's. Yeah, illegal in almost every state. Now, it's probably off topic, but I, what I want to know is back when I was a kid, I seen some people and they had these ones hanging from their uh, rearview mirrors and they're naked ladies and you get oh, them hey. at the nudie store. Oh, yeah, the air fresh. Now, A, can you still get them? B, can you much, ship them to us? Can you ship them to us? C, how much are they? We give them to us for free. That's what I got to say about it. And that. did they smell like dirty vagina? <laughs> probably. They smell, probably smelled like real musky cologne. Yeah. You know, like, Mainly man. I'm just wondering, like, because if you buy a naked woman air freshener, you expect it to smell like a naked woman. Well, no, you, yeah, but maybe, because you want your whole place to smell like this musty love, love. But you do know. you want it to smell like dirty, beaten vagina, or do you want it to smell like... No, you want it to smell like this, you know, a musk, so girls, you know, they're attracted to the musk, you know? Oh. You know, like, whenever I wear the button-down shirts, I have several buttons undone, so my yeah. fucking... 
My beef curtains are hanging out. <laughs> Your beef curtains. Here, let me put it. All right, it's like the jungle. You know what I mean? A lot of the jungle. Got yeah, it. like in the jungle, there's lions in the jungle, right? In the jungle, the mighty jungle. Exactly. Like something. You know, you're in the jungle, baby. You might, you might die. Turn off sleeves till dawn. So there's a line. I don't remember what the fuck I was talking about. That's good. All right, next one. You may be arrested for vagrancy. If you do not have at least one dollar bill on your person. Wow, then you're a vagrant. That's me. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's classes. That's yeah. sexist. I never carry cash on me. I never do either. What if you got one of them credit cards and, uh, you know, like can us. They, can they swipe your card and check your credit, maybe? Yeah, maybe. I'd be like, well, I'm Jim Bob McClain. They'd yeah. be like, oh, all right. He's got this new thing where he walks around and goes, I'm Jim Bob, bitches. Yeah, and they go, Jim Bob McClain, sometimes. And, and I say, yeah, and they go, oh, we hate you. Or, or they're like, get the hell out of here. Yep. All right, next one. All right, uh, you may be arrested for, oh, I, you, I read that one. Uh, you must contact the police before entering a building in an automobile. Entering the city in an automobile, Jim Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Building is not even on there. What is wrong with me? <laughs> wow, I'm off nope. my shit right now. No I more apologize. IPAs for Jim Bob. The, all right. <laughs> you must contact the police before entering the city. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get out of Bill Jim. Jeez. You need to slide. I just well, do this myself. Well, we went touring there in Illinois one time, and we didn't have to contact anybody because we didn't know about that rule, so I hope there's not warrants out for our arrest. Well, back then, it was Mike. It was the manager, so he probably contacted them for us. That's true, and if anybody Hopefully. wants to get a hold of us for that, just contact Mike. Yeah, because it's his fault. Yep. Let Bob and clients treat me well. All right, the English language is not to be spoken. We're in the English capital of the damn world. I don't know well, why. Well, that's a good thing we speak Southern. That's, that's very that's, true. We speak Southern, so we can talk all we fucking We also want. speak the real fucking that's American. What, yeah, that's right. yippee ki yay mother. Oh, look, where are we at? All right, mm -hmm. well, now we're going into the cities of Illinois. Right. This is Carbondale. What? Must yeah. have a lot of carbon. Must. Phosphorus. Blow out them pipes. It could. It could. All right. Uh, no one may stand on the sidewalk on the 500 block of Ill on the 500 block of Illinois Avenue. But this was retracted because they they realized <laughs> 500 block ain't as bad as what people say it is. Yeah. I mean, back in the day, people used to get shot there all the time. It used to be a big gang place. Yeah. People were shooting up heroin on block 500 and a half. I mean, that's what I heard. It was a bad. It was a bad place. It was a different yeah. time. So, yeah. but. Now the U.S. military just went in there and they completely claimed the streets. <laughs> Wiped it out. So <laughs> it's yeah. been retracted. It's yeah. safe now. You can stay in there. It's interesting. I, you know, like some of these places I do recognize from touring and stuff, and I yeah. do remember that place is real bad. Yeah, but it was like guys. Northern Ireland. It was fucking Belfast in Illinois, right there. Yeah, Belfast in the seventies when shit was going down. Like soccer rides. And shit, shit was popping. Yep. All right, champagne. Oh, cool. One may not pee in his neighbor's mouth. <laughs> well, what do you know what they could probably call when you pee in somebody's mouth in champagne? It's champagne. <laughs> oh, yeah, let's go champagne and um, pee in my mouth, I'll pee in yours. Uh, That's a good. <clears throat> Hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again. You know, I have nothing. Some uh, girls want to get kinky, but you know, I ain't in that peeing into my mouth stuff. I have nothing. All right, next one. Chicago. Now, this is uh, Chirac, they call it. This is uh, Chicago, but this is uh, Illinois, Chicago. Same thing? No. Chir yeah, Chicago. Oh, oh, is Chicago a state? No, Chicago is a city. <coughs> in, yeah, inside of Illinois. In, in Illinois. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Exactly. Why, why won't you listen? Yeah, so they call it Chirac. Yeah. There's a lot of ki shootings there, a lot of gangs. It is the deadliest, or uh, it has the number one homicide rate in the United States as of now. Believe that. Believe that. All right, uh, is it my turn? Yep. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> all right. That should be a shirt right there, Jim Ball's face. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> uh, all right, citizens can be hit with a $120 ticket for having an improperly displayed and outdated city sticker on their car. I think that, well, that's, that's a lot of money. Outdated city sticker. It must be some kind of weird stickers they put on their cars down there. I wonder if that's kind of, eh. Yeah. So maybe that's kind of like a uh, registration sticker, an inspection sticker we have. It here. could be. It could be. Maybe they call them city stickers. If you guys are interested, you can go on www.dumblaws.com and then you can uh, look up about this law and it tells you more about the law and you can go maybe. deeper. Maybe it's supposed to be city slicker. That's what it looked like. A country boy in the city. Yep. 
Yep, like that movies with uh, uh, that one guy, Woody Harrelson. Cowboy's no, way. no, no. That, that's a good one. But Carlitos way. They had that little scrawny guy. Shot town. No, nah. not another name for Chicago. Yeah, shot town. Shot town. Shot to everybody. Shot there, I guess. Or uh, what is popular known for is uh, Chicago. You know, the city where you get your ass shot. That's right. Where Oprah's, Oprah's from. All right. All next right. one. All business and all businesses entering into contracts with the city must sift through their records and report any business that they had dealing with slaves during the era of slavery. Wow. I can kind of understand that. They're making sure there ain't people. Yeah, they're making sure there ain't no sons of bitches in there. Yeah, yeah. I kind of get that. Well, I got. I, 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 I agree with that. Yeah, I can understand where that's coming from. But on the other hand, these ones aren't so dumb. On the other hand, they shouldn't be they criticized for the acts hey, of their. You know what? Four covers. That, that's that's a good point. And sometimes, you know, like whenever I was thirteen and I was doing all this crazy shit, like things I can't really say because I might get in trouble. You know, there's uh, a statute of limitations. Exactly. You know. exactly. You'll be all right. Exactly. Well, whenever I was running over those animals and stuff. Yeah, don't talk about that. <laughs> all right. Well, whenever I was doing all that crazy stuff and that crazy and then crazy times, I can't be judged for that now because I'm not the same person. I'm a different person. I'm saying you know? I'm further than that. I'm saying you can't be judged for the acts of your ancestors. Yeah, that's a better point. You are your own person. Yeah, yeah. Just because my dad used to go to the bank with his dick hanging out of his yeah, uh, I mean, short legs, is, shorts. You had purpose. nothing to do with that. Yeah, yeah. I'm just kidding, Dad. I, yeah, I know. All right, anyways, anyways. come here. All right, sorry. Um, law forbids eating in a place that is on fire. Wow, that's a good law. See no, it. it's not. If you're eating in a place that's no, on no, fire, it's not, it, it forbids. It's just why the fuck are you eating in a place? Yeah, and I'm 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 good with that. Like if you're eating in a place that's on fire, you're probably fucking stupid and need to go. Whoa, well, that's a good point. So, yeah, there shouldn't even be a law. Those people are gonna get burned up. I'm not for it. laws to keep stupid people alive. Yeah, I'm not into laws at all, Clint. Well, I'm just kidding. Next one. I like some laws. All right, it is illegal to give dog whiskey. Well, I'd be in jail. I feed my dog Scooter whiskey all the time. I agree time. with that. He and loves I hate, it. I hate when you do it because it's just a waste of good whiskey. <laughs> yeah, but Scooter, Scooter, he has such a good time. Oh, mate, if you see him. Pete, I'm just kidding. I just thought your dog was retarded. I didn't realize oh, that's why no, I was always no, stumbling no. around. Uh, every day, instead of water, I give him whiskey. Yeah, that to. makes sense. Yep, yeah, a little Scooter. All right, it is forbidden to fish while sitting on a giraffe's neck. Now, There's where in... Fucking Chicago, is there in Chi Town, you gonna get a giraffe? At hey, the zoo, so you, they don't allow you to go in there with the animals. It Those... should be you are forbidden to fucking steal a giraffe and take it fishing. Yeah, like Harambe or whatever <laughs> that Harambe, that monkey that dragged that little boy and then they shot him. Oh yeah, they shouldn't have shot that monkey. Man, rest in peace, Harambe. I know that's an old meme and stuff, but I'm yeah, just they saying they shouldn't have shot that fucking monkey. The boy shouldn't have been in this neighborhood. That's right. If you're in there with that giraffe, they would have shot the giraffe too. And if you're in Chicago, then you know you. Stay out of other people's fucking neighborhoods. That's right. Or else you get shot. That's right. You watch your pizza. They shouldn't have shot the monkey. They should have shot the kid. Cross your P's and Q's in Chicago. I mean, don't shoot the kid. That's fucking wrong, but... Yeah. It's not the monkey's fault. The monkey was doing what a monkey does. That's right. Don't shoot anybody out there. Guys. Yes. Just let's be nice to each other. Yeah. All right. Is this mine? I think so. All right. Cats may be flown within the city. Yeah. May not be may flown not. within the city limits. Well, I get it. There's planes flying. They might... If you're flying a fucking kite high enough to hit a plane. <laughs> well, some people got long strings, Clint. <laughs> yes, so God damn. Get with the times, 2018, man. Hey, I ain't with the long string kite, 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 I am. That's messed up. I am. All right, in the Pullman era, it is illegal to drink beer out of a bucket while sitting on the curb. I don't, well, you know, sometimes. Sometimes you ain't got a glass. You know. I hate to say it, I drank out of weirder things than that. Think about it this way. You can't drink out of a glass because you ain't got a glass. It's true. But if you have a can and you drink it out of the can, then you have an open container. So if you pour it into a bucket, that's you true. drink it out of a bucket. That's you know true. what they say? Two tears in a bucket. Fuck, Fuck it. it. That's right. And then you couldn't drink it out of your shoe, but then you're drinking an athlete's foot in your mouth and yeah, stuff, that's and that's not, not right. good. Next one. All right. Uh, it is legal to... Uh, it is legal to protest naked in front of City Hall as long as you are under 17 years of age and have legal permits. Wait, what the fuck did I just read right there? No. It, it is legal to protest naked. Oh, unless you're under 17. But even 17-year-olds? I thought it was... I don't know about No, this. as long as you are under 17. So, like, you're not allowed if you're 18. It means 1 through fucking 17. No, 1 through 16. You can protest naked in front of a building. Now that's well, fucking. Well, that pedophile. sounds disgusting. No yes. wonder they had to law about pedophiles. Wow. 
You're letting fucking kids Jeez. walk around naked until they're 16 protesting and shit. That ain't right. Let's, let's move on. Why that's wouldn't it be 18 and above? I, I agree. Adults. I agree. It's not even a dumb law. That's a civically wrong. That's a morally wrong law right there. Oh, that's fucked up. All right. Um, Sirio? Sirio. 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 Sicaro. Sicaro. Cicero. Cicero. All right. Humming on public streets is... Knock that shit off. Oh, sorry. Humming on public streets is prohibited on Sundays. They don't want you to be happy there. No, they don't. No, they don't want you to be happy at all. You can't even hum. I mean, sometimes I'm so broke and stuff, that's all I have is humming. Yeah, humming in less than a dollar bill on me, so I'm getting arrested. Yep, jerking off in my pocket, <clears throat> humming. And drinking beer out of a bucket. Yep, that's right. All right. Connellsville. Collinsville. Collinsville. It is illegal to wear saggy pants in Collinsville, Illinois. I agree with that, because if you're wearing saggy pants and your ass is hanging out, you're advertising. Well, you know... But the other fags are going to want your ass. you got to wear saggy pants and keep them held up, which I have a problem doing. But uh, if you keep them held up, then your balls get you know, a whole bunch of room to do their thing and grow like they're it, supposed to grow. But it's a proven fact, sagging your pants started in the prison system. It was a sh oh, way yeah. of showing the other men that, hey, my asshole is for your taking. That, that, yeah, I've heard that. That sounds true. So we're gonna go. We're gonna stop part one here, with keep your pants up. That's true. Or else you're probably gonna get the D in the A. Yep, because you're advertising for it. Yeah, you're yep. asking for it, really. I mean, it's no different than them women walking around with their with their hooters hanging out. It, because, you're asking for it. Yep, keep them jugs in where you want them, unless you want them sucked. So. That's in Bob. It's my body, and I want to be free. Fuck you. You're asking for it. That's true. And of course, Sorry. see you next time. Bye. <laughs> Wait, 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 hold on. Wait, wait, wait. All right. Hey, guys, make sure you guys go and check out the Patreon channel. That's right, because over there is some shit that you're not going to be able to see on the regular channel. You know, we got some, like, behind the scenes and just crazy shit. Interesting stories about the videos themselves. So make sure you check that shit out. Hey, what, what do they need to do? Well, they make, make sure you need to uh, like the videos. Yeah. You need to comment on the videos. Yeah. And you, uh, what's that last one? Uh, subscribe to the channel. Oh, That's yeah. It. All right, well, All we'll right. see you later. All right.